My name is Hannah Biddlecombe and I created the Melanie Martinez Miss Potato Head music video. <laughs> it's a mouthful. Um, how do you think of the idea? Um, honestly, I just gotten into her music and I was just kind of sitting at home and I started seeing images as well as listening to her music and I thought that would be a cool video to do, so that's kind of how I got it. <laughs> Uh, I think it was when I was younger and everyone was telling me I was like outgoing and loud and stuff. I didn't really know what to put that in. And then I saw, like I'm just really into movies and stuff like that, and I saw other people making movies and I'm like, maybe I'd be into that. So I just started and haven't stopped. Yeah. <laughs> what is your name and what films you create? Uh, my name is Dorian Murphy and I directed Sweater of Doom and produced Pizza P.I. Okay. Um, what, uh, what inspired you to see? Um, for Sweater of Doom, we were given the title Sweater of Doom and so we kind of just worked backwards from there. And then for Pizza P.I., um, I was chosen as producer of that film. So. Is it, <laughs> is it tough to create a film? Um, yeah. <laughs> I don't know how to elaborate more on that, but yeah, it's, it's like, no matter what, you're always going to have problems with each film, so you just kind of, the show must go wrong, and then you just pick it up from there. <laughs> well, congratulations. Thank you. What's your name and what film did you create? My name is Hannah Pavlis and my film was Learning to Forget. What um, inspired you to get that title? My AP English teacher told us to write an essay about how we learned to read and instead when I went to write it that's what I wrote and so I titled it Learning to Forget as kind of like a nod to like what I was supposed to be writing about. Um, what was your inspiration other than the um, my teacher told us that when we write, we have to write truths, well, uh, even if it's not our truth. And so I wanted to write somebody else's truth. Instead of talking about me, I wanted to give somebody else's story a chance to be seen. Thank you. Congratulations. Your name and what film you choose? I'm Carson Wilder, and I made the film Nights of Fantasy. What is your film about? Uh, it's about a kid who's playing in the backyard and using his imagination to pretend he's in a sword fight. Um, what challenges did you face in creating this film? We were filming later in the day, so the sun was going down. That's always a challenge when you have to uh, keep the lighting consistent. So that's probably our biggest challenge on set. Um, what inspired you to create this film? Um, it's based off my younger brother, just watching him play outside and seeing how he uh, comes up with stories in his own head. Yeah. And congratulations. Thank you. What's your name and what film did you create? My name is Dominic Krupp and I made the film Upright. Um, what is your film about? It's about a girl who is working from home and she hears her piano playing, so and there's no one else in the house, so she goes to investigate. What inspired you to create this film? Um, well, I, around the time I made it, I had been in horror films, watching them and kind of studying them and figuring out what, what scares and what works and what doesn't work. And uh, I wanted to make something with um, kind of a, a profound, so to say, ending that uh, holds out until the very end. Mm -hmm. 
Thank you. <laughs> Hi, what's your name and what film did you play? I'm Lula Thomas and I made Pure Imagination. What is your film about? Um, it's about a person just writing, like walking around and they just imagine the whole new world around What inspired you to create this I wanted to push myself to do something that I'm not exactly used to, so I just wanted to create something that I guess I've never really created. How would you explain being a filmmaker? It's a lot of hard work, and you have to put in a lot of effort and creativity to make just something unique, something that you want to do. Congratulations. Thank you guys. Thank you guys. Good job, man. Good job.